Welcome back to what I presume is going to be the final stream slash episodes of the Moon Wonderlock. That's the plan for today is to finish this game up and just get it done with. I might be here for four hours, might be here for five hours, might be here for an hour and a half. I don't know. We're here. I got my brand new blue mic, so shit should sound nice and good. And uh, yeah, let's get right into it. Let's get you guys a team recap real quick, just because I also need one. It's been a couple weeks. Taking too long to finish this thing up. I did kind of cut the screen a little too small on the bottom screen. But I'm really not going to worry about it, honestly. We got Charizard, who is chilling with Dragon Rage, Outrage, Dragon Dance, and Flare Blitz. Sitting there with that naughty nature. We got a jolly natured Raticate, who is hanging out with U-Turn, Crunch, Super Fang, and Sucker Punch. Got the gluttony ability, so eh, you know, not bad, not terrible. Uh, Garchomp is sitting out with a lax nature. Got Brick Break, Crunch, Dragon Claw, and Dig. Gyarados has got Ice Fang, Crunch, Aqua Tail, and Dragon Ants. Gyarados is amazing. Love Gyarados. With the Impish Nature, my personal favorite nature for a Gyarados. Uh, positive defense and negative special defense. Special attack. And then you got Hoof Picks, who is actually Nine Tails, but this one came with a nickname. We got the Toxic, because why not? Mist, Hex, Dazzling, Gleam. We're showing with the Raquinid, who's got Leech Life, Crunch, Bug Bite, and Scald. And a Raquinid's been here since like day two. So, as weird as it might sound, I'm very attached to Araquanid, and we're going to try our hardest to not let her faint above all else. Uh, we obviously need Garchomp and Gyarados and stuff like that. First to go would be Raticate. <laughs> Sorry. I like Raticate, but it, it's Eradicate, so. But we're going to lead out with whoever our lowest level with itch is Hoofpicks. Actually, Charizard is, but I know Charizard can handle his own, so I'm not too worried about it. He's also got EVs already. I'm doing some battling here and there. So, let's get this going, guys. I believe we're on the fourth island, so we're going to have to bust our way through that real quick. Let's head on down here. And up here, guys. Alright. Oh, my goodness. I'm pretty excited to finish Moon Wonder Lock. I wish I had changed the time on my 2DS back. Because I'm not doing the freaking Pokepalago glitch anymore. Because I had to update this 2DS so I could play online with it. But, yeah, they fixed that in case you guys didn't know. What's up, Lily? Pony Island, it's a completely different kind of island, isn't it? Oh, that's it. We already got our opponent on an encounter with an execute. So, we're actually going to do some training, though. What's up, girl? We want battle? Because we need to do some training. The Pokemon and trainer's feelings are stacked together. They try, try receiving the Unleashed Z-Power. Alright. <laughs> like, thanks, homegirl, I guess. I appreciate it. Challenge by Ace Trainer Lindsay. What's up, Lindsay? So glad I got my viewer software working again because it wasn't working, but Katsu Kitty sent me uh, like a thing to fix it up, basically, a new product key. And shout out to Katsu Kitty. I, I sent them an email as well, but shout out to them, man. That's amazing because not many companies really will do that, you know? And I actually do need to fix this as much as I don't like to do it right now because it's just a little bit too cut. Uh, let me just size it down a little bit. Shouldn't be too hard of a fix, right? Just a tiny bit. I might have cut it too short just to begin with. Yeah, I mean, you know what? I'm honestly just going to run with it, guys. If it bothers you, I'm sorry. It doesn't bother me too much at looking like that because I know what it says. You know, so the bottom screen's kind of a pain in the ass to get able to get, like, captured properly. But uh, let's see. What are you? You're a poison type. So I don't really want to be in here. Yeah, I don't want to be in here at all. There's nothing I can do to him. So hoof picks. Let's get you out of here. Good job, buddy. You did a good job. <laughs> yeah. First battle, we're going to swap you right out. Um, it's going to be a Garchomp's of Poison, so I think... Scrum resist Poison or is Rock? I think Rock does. Let's go Garchomp, though. I think Garchomp should be alright. And yeah, I need to think of names for all of them and stuff like that, but I have... Ooh, Gunk Shot's going to fucking hurt, though. It's going to hurt anybody, doesn't... Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> Garchomp, it is not very fed. Okay, so ground does resist, in case you guys are wondering. Um, Let's go for the dig. Because I'd rather have Earthquake, but we don't get Earthquake for quite a little while. So, Get your way underground, Gar Garchomp. Let's go. <clears throat> and I'm kind of noticing the viewers a little bit fuzzier than it was in the last couple episodes. So... There's not too much I can do with the Moon Wonderlock at this point, honestly, because it's very far into it. Like, I've got, I've played a lot of this game. I'm near the end of it. 
it's it's gotten to the point where it's like I can't really fix it too much beyond what it is now, you know. So I'll, I'll have to look into the viewer into what I can fix with that. But in case you guys are wondering why it's a little grainy, it's not by choice. Uh, probably one of the filters is set up wrong. I had it all set up before, and then my C drive crashed and just fucked my whole life up for a little while. So that's why everything's been kind of a pain in the ass to get back into everything and make sure everything's working properly. Because I've had to re-download every pro every program I've ever had in my life, reset it up and everything. So. Oh, man, this Garchomp comes ready, dude. Gunk Shock and Protect. Gunk Shot and Protect. Damn. I don't think Poison kills you, though, even if you run around with it afterwards. Obviously, in battle it will, though. Um, I don't really want to risk Garchomp, honestly. I'm going to heal up because I'm not, I'm not trying to play that game. Like, Garchomp's our pseudo. We lost Metagross. That was my bad. We didn't have to lose Metagross by any means. Or Metagross by any means. But he, he was gone, so... He is gone. Um, so we're not losing Garchomp. Like, there ain't no way, no how, dude. Gabite almost fainted when we were training. But he's good. A lot of almost fainting while we were training. Magikarp almost fainted. God damn, dude. This thing is doing a lot of damage. I'm going to need you to... Oh, my goodness. We almost just died there. This Garbodor needs to get out of my face, dude. All right, so Garchomp's going to definitely need some EVs because he just doesn't really... Oh, my goodness. Did he toxic me? Toxapex. Okay, that, that gives us a good reason to get the hell out of here, dude. What the fuck, man? That thing was wrecking our house. Uh, if it's a, if it's a Toxapex, it's the only way to ground. Shit. Let's go Gyarados. <laughs> this game is so hard now, man. When you're trying to like raise up a whole new team you haven't played through the entire game with, like all their EVs get reset and everything. It's alright though. We can do this. We got a good team. We have a good team. Stinky is a tiny, tiny, tiny bit lackluster, but you know what? We can work around it. I'm a D-Dance. We're not playing any games with this Toxapex right now. Uh, Poison doesn't resist Dark. We just saw that, so... Oh, you Z moving me? What are you using? Z toxic or some shit? Oh my goodness. Acid downpour. Holy shit. Can we take this? We're an impish nature, boy. Come on, bud. Come on, bud. Oh, you're good, Gyarados. Gyarados. Gyarados, you are beautiful. How did you eat that Z move? He ate that from breakfast, man. Crunch him. <coughs> These battles are nothing to mess with. Oh my goodness. Mmm, that was a crit. Oh my goodness. This whole team is poison. I love poison types, but I hate facing poison types. I'm gonna have to D-Dance again to do anything. We're gonna crunch. We're gonna see if we can get like a D-Drop or something. But I think it's just a wiser... Did we get two crits? No. That first crit was just a little lackluster then, huh? Damn, dude. You get the crit, though. Fuck, dude. Let's playing seems so simple when you're not the one let's playing. Like, I used to give people so much shit when I'm like, what are you doing, dude? Stop heal spamming. It's a different story when you're the one who needs to heal spam. I'm not losing Gyarados. <laughs> like, this team needs to beat the Elite Four. <clears throat> I wasn't flipping somebody off in England. If that's what you thought I was doing, I wasn't. Is two. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, yeah, that's that's flipping off in England, right? Yeah. Gyarados. Gyarados. I need to heal. <laughs> I'm sorry, I need to heal. I'm not messing with it, man. I'm not messing with it. We're not using super potion. What the hell am I doing? We have money. We have dollar bills, y'all. We can do this. This is really <laughs> Fuck this. <laughs> Okay. Oh my god. What was that? Three crits? Are we serious right now? Does he have a high... Does he have Sniper? And I'm missing something here? We have to go for Crunch. I'm not playing this game with you, Toxapex. Please, Gyarados. You have a Dragon Dance set up, bud. Woo, Gyarados. Scare me a little bit there, Gyarados. Oh my goodness, dude. Scare me a lot. Actually, we're going to care. Because I'm not looking to uh, run all the way back to heal the poison off. I think we have Antidotes, but still. Gyarados looks drunk as shit, dude. Come on. 
Bring the screen down. Come on, bring the screen down, dude. Really? There we go. It's like, dude. You gotta be joking right now. Alright, Gyarados. Homie, homie. How many poison spots you got, homie? Homie. Homie. Oh my goodness. Okay, come on. Am I doing something wrong here? Did I miss something on the bottom? Okay, now Gyarados. Oh my goodness. That takes forever, dude. Like, I get what they're going for, but like... Yo, just let me get rid of it. <laughs> Switch. Let's heal Garchomp while we're here, too, though. Ah, look at that. Garchomp is small enough. Good. Circle all around him. Get those little poison spots, dude. Garchomp looks really skinny on the viewer over there. <laughs> Very skinny, actually. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, that's almost gone. Look, a little... It's just a little... Hey, there we go. Okay, Garchomp, be good. You don't, you don't get any berries, though. Not really performing yet. <laughs> like, once you guys start performing, you'll get some berries. All right. I love how they don't talk to you in this game. I know that sounds bad. And so, okay, so I don't remember the last episode if we got the Master Ball or not. Because I don't remember getting the Master Ball, but I had it when I received the Pidgeotite, Steeloxite, and Heracronite, and Houndoomite. And all of a sudden, I had a Master Ball, too. So I don't know if that's where I got it from or if it was from the last episode. Because I haven't recorded, like, two weeks. Longer than that, like, two and a half weeks, actually. What TMs do we have that are new? Flash Cannon, I guess? Okay. And we do have a full heal, which is nice. We're just going to Hyper Potion up Garchomp real quick. Give him all that HP back. Almost all the HP back. And then we'll just Super Potion the Gyarados. Or my Gyarados. The Gyarados. <coughs> I mean, he is the only Gyarados, so to be fair. Uh, let's go up here. we got to bust our way through Pony Wilds a little faster than what we're doing right now. So if i got to start using Charizard to kind of clean up for a little while, turn the ESP share on. So be it. Um, crown probably. <laughs> okay, and we are gonna face wild Pokemon as well because I need to get some experience. So we're just gonna dazzle and gleam it. We could toxic hex it, but I'm gonna dazzle and gleam. We got stab with dazzle and gleam. Dude, it's really, really blurry. Like, honestly, I'm going to have to work on that for, like, my next playthrough on 3DS, or 2DS. Because it's significantly blurrier than it was, so there's just some settings i got to mess with. It doesn't bother me too much, so I hope it doesn't bother you too much, but... I need to just buy a 3DS capture card, but... It's another $700, and it's just like... Uh, <laughs> like, I don't have that, so that, that's a... It's like two of my paychecks now that I took a different job. <laughs> like, oh, okay, come on. What do you got? Do you have Hidden Power Fire? You yeah, don't. Well, you're going to get Body Gastrod on, so we need that experience, boy. Good job, Gastrod on. Get out of here. Oh, that's right. I have milk next to me. Sick, dude. I was sitting there, man. I'm so thirsty. We're good. All right. Got to spill the milk on your shirt or it's not, you're not actually drinking it then. Just so you guys know. Uh, there's an item up here I want. Want through that grass real quick. Found a max potion. I'm down. Thank you, Max, for your potion. All right. Uh, oh, give me that fart cloud, dude. Hell yeah, I got, got the fart cube. Whatever, fart cube, fart cloud. That's the same thing. Fart quad. Uh, I never knew when I was a little kid, fart quad is like a... Synonym, I guess, for uh, fuckwad. <laughs> like, I never thought about that until I got older. And I watched a video on it. And I was like, oh shit. <laughs> I see what you're doing, Shrek creators. Alright, what's up, Phil? <laughs> F-I-L. Alright. Now, you know what he says you have to do the uh, PH, but it is more aesthetically pleasing than F-I-L. In my most humble of opinions. Alright, Parasect. Parasect, oh, Parasect, you are a bug grass type. Which means you can't do much to me. Both your stabs I resist. Those dazzling gleam and see what he's got. Come on, Phil, what do you got for me, bud? Uh, oh, okay, you have a spore, so... He could do that to me, though. <laughs> like, alright, that works too, I suppose. Thank you, Phil. Alright, Phil, we're gonna get on out of here, Phil. 
Uh, I guess Charizard is probably a pretty solid option. I don't believe it reads your moves uh, in this game. So it won't read that I'm swapping to Charizard. So I, won't, I don't think it'll spore me again. Yeah, Fury Cutter. Four times resisted, boy. He was cool. I don't care how set up you are. Four times resisted. And I kind of want to do three sets of big ones on this one. Unless you want to do the third set with little ones. You want to do that? Alrighty. <laughs> what are you going to do to me, Rabombi? There's another one that we resist all of your stabs. All two of them. So, we're just going to flare blitz you too. Are you faster than me? Of course you're faster than me. You're Rabombi. Of course you are. So don't do too much damage because i got to take damage now too because of flare blitz. You're right. No, what? All right, fair enough. <clears throat> okay. And that is Dunzo. I gotta tell you, this little dragon pad filter thing that I bought, like, it's pretty cool when the Ugo smoke, the smoke hits it. You guys don't see it, obviously. But it kind of tapers to the back of it. It's pretty dope. Lit. I don't know, dude. <laughs> Whatever you're going for, I suppose. Uh, let's actually heal up Charizard, because... We're not risking anything. We got money. We're making money as we go along. And at the same time, I'm kind of used to, like, I was playing a lot of Pokemon Coliseum. So I'm used to being able to call and just wake my Pokemon up instead of full healing them. But hey, you know what? We're not playing Coliseum. We are playing a better game, in my opinion. I love Coliseum to death. And you guys should totally watch the playthrough that I'm putting up on YouTube after this one. And it'll be in a couple days when you guys watch this, but... Oh, Nihihi! He didn't say that, but Nihihi! What up? It's good to see you again, too, Mudsdale. You look to be in form. Sorry, Garchomp's head's in the way. <laughs> wow, Pokemon training trainers really do amaze me. It seems like a hard path to walk. And even so, you don't let yourself be held back by the fear of seeing your Pokemon friend get hurt. You just keep striving forward together. Yep. There's a little bit of shade there, though. Oh, been a while, Brad. And you brought Lily along, too. Yes, it's good to see you too, Hoppy. Hapu? Hoppy? <laughs> you look different. Like you're ready to go all out or something now. Thank you, Hoppy. <laughs> I finally discovered what I need to do. <laughs> so this is my Z-powered form. <laughs> yeah, stop laughing. <laughs> Hold and do your best, Lily. No one could call you Liver Lily. Lily Liver. That's funny. I like that. I like Hapu. I think she's one of my favorite characters, actually. Um, so Hapu, do you know where we could find the Kahuna? The Kahuna? Hmm. Don't have one here on Pony. What? Now what do we do, Brad? <coughs> I already finished up my battle against the odd thing that appeared out of the sky. You're the Kahuna, don't lie to us. Alright, let us proceed to the ruins. You stick with me, you two. That was a very loud whoa. I'm sorry if that was really loud for you guys. That might have been, that came out really loud of my speakers, because I didn't turn my speakers down. But, oh my god, I just spilled milk everywhere. Well, fuck the milk, right, dude? Thank you for the follow, though, I appreciate it. <laughs> it's alright, there's no electronics or anything right next to me, so we're fine. Brad, we just have to keep going, right? But then again, you are a trainer, aren't you? I suppose you always keep moving forward. I didn't catch your name who followed me, if somebody followed me, or if it just randomly played that. I think it just randomly played that because, oh, I bet you it popped up on the one behind this Pokemon call. Sam, I'll have to check who followed me, but thank you. Though. I appreciate it. Um, wait there. Wait, wait there. Oh, look at this old lady, dude. Eek. <laughs> that old lady, dude. Oh my goodness. You know, only a little bit of milk honestly spilled. It just went everywhere. I I'm sorry. I don't think we've been introduced. Oh, <laughs> I'm Hapu's old gran. Are you two friends with my girl? Yeah, we are, yeah. <laughs> so she has friends now. Well, that's fucking... A little bit more shade, Pokemon. Damn. Traveling around the islands, making new friends. You kids are luckier than you know. Ugh. He's just like, yo, check it out, dude. <laughs> you want to hear about the Pony Island ruins? How about you get a bit of help from this old grand here? Hand, head over, hand over your ride pager a moment. Oh, so we give him a champ here. Dope. 
Well, I probably won't go through and get those items for a little while because honestly, like, they're not randomized or anything. All the Machamp items and stuff. Sorry, milk them on. Uh, they're not randomized or anything, so it won't be anything special. But we did get the creepy Machamp ride pager, which I like it, but I see why people don't. Son of a bitch, dude. And more than I thought. <laughs> you'll need some. You'll need to move some big obstacles to make it down the path you hope to travel. I wish you both a bright future. Well, thank you, Grandma. Much appreciated. Much, much appreciated. Mahapu was heading for the ruins of hope, wasn't she? Go after her. First, you'll come to Pony Breaker Coast. You'll need to. You'll need. You know it by its soil. It's black. Its pitch is black. Black as pitch. Pitch black. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Go through there, and you'll find the ruins. Thank you very much, ma'am. You'll, you'll have a great. You'll be. You've been a great help. Oh my God! If I could speak, this would be a much better let's play. The Ruins of Hope. That's where the Guardian of Pearly Island will be. That is where Tapu Finney lives. Let's go. All right, I'm down. Let's go. Uh, do I have like a towel or anything? I don't have a towel or anything, so we're just gonna keep playing. I got milk on my side, but I don't care. It's relaxing. It's actually really cooling. Um, this arm right here is like really cool. I dig it. You know, feels good. Um, so we're not. I don't think we go up straight yet. Let's go over here. Oh, just kidding. Hold on. I don't think it's a very good team, if I remember, though. Oh, we have to go around with. Um, I know you get surf and waterfall up here. What the hell? Got me all kinds of fumbled up, huh? Uh, Pony Breaker Coast. We'll take on this chick, and then we'll get an encounter here, I think. And then we'll trade something out and get this Wonderlock moving again. You're challenged by Sightseer Jamie. What up, Jamie? Sandshrew? Okay, I think we can handle the Sandshrew. Is it, oh, it's not a Lolan. That's right, Sightseer. I forgot they always have those. Really glad my po my phone wasn't in my right pocket. That would have, uh... That would not have been very fun. <laughs> like, so let's Dazzle and Gleam real quick. I'm still gonna drink the rest of this milk, but I don't care. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, we're good. Whoa, hoof picks. Let's get you on out of there, girl. How's that sound? Good job living that hit, though, Hoof Picks. Okay. Now that that's drank, so we can't spill it on ourselves again. Dig. Well, you know, I think I can deal with Dig. I'm, I'm going to D-Dance. Just because we got a free D-Dance, basically. It don't affect me, dude. Way to waste your turn, huh? Way to waste your turn, Sandshrew. Good job, bud. Alright, Sandshrew's hit by that. Oh, yeah, let me check. Uh, should have it on my phone. No? Ah, right, there we go. Spirit Rider 87. Well, thank you for the follow, Spirit Rider 87. I think he left just now, right as I was saying that, because it went down to one. But either way, Spirit Rider, thank you for uh, following me. Hopefully he didn't just take that follow back. <laughs> like, that's what I'm banking on here. <laughs> uh, let's Ice Fang again. Screw it. You have Sturdy? At least you ain't Galvanize. You do have Sturdy, though. Do you have Sturdy? Or you... Oh, did you just live that? Hold up. Gyarados. It's just a Geodude, Gyarados. Gyarados is just a Geodude. Okay. I was like, Gyarados? You don't fuck me over, Gyarados. <laughs> like... Graveler, huh? Keep battling. <clears throat> uh, you know what? I'm actually not really looking to fuck with a uh, Graveler and see if he wants to kill me or not. So let's just do this to Gyarados real quick. <laughs> like, I'm not fucking around with that. Oh my goodness. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Oh my gosh. Okay. If I got a heal span to get past these Gravelers and Geodudes, I don't give a shit. I, 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 don't, I don't... That was a crit, dude. Gyarados is a monster. Alright, Vulpix. No, I think we can handle a Vulpix, I think. I think we're a little better on that one. I like how all the Sightseers specifically have the Pokemon that are seen in Alola, though. It's kind of standard RPG coincidence. <coughs> I don't know if that's you watching or not. Um, 
Sonic Rider 87, but thank you for the. Oh, and he went away right there, too. Never mind. I was trying to say thank you, but that's good. Uh, let's, uh, Aqua Tail. Twitch is so weird because it takes forever for it to, like, update how many people are watching. So it'll update, and then by the time you're saying something to that person, it's, they're gone. It's like, oh, okay, cool. Deuces. <laughs> like. Ah, my Pokemon didn't get infused with power. I spilled all that milk. Can you give me a towel? <coughs> like. I was waiting for Anna to get back because it's just milk all over my side. Um, there we go, okay, let's grab this item real quick. Uh, oh wait, we didn't get an encounter on Ancient Pony Path, did we? I don't think we did, so I'm going to count this, and if by some chance we did, you guys can rectify that in the comments. Thank you. Okay. Oh, hoof picks. Hoof picks, I didn't heal you. Please, be careful with me, Gramble. Don't hurt me. Um... Shit. Oh, don't hurt me, Gramble. No pursuit. I don't know if he has pursuit, but I, I, I'm always scared of that. I will always be scared of that. I will take that nice intimidate, though. Rage. All right. I think we can handle rage. Not an issue on that one. Let's Ice Fang him real quick. We could crunch him. Because uh, not very effective, but Ice Fang works, too. Oh, I was like, what? Uh, I want to crunch him. Because it's not very effective, so we should do just a little bit. Get him into that yellow range. Rage is still building. He's getting... Oh, lick. Alright. Whatever then, I guess. <laughs> like, let's uh, Ultra Ball it up real quick. Mm, how many Master Balls do I have? I do only have one Master Ball. Maybe I was just given the Master Ball in the last episode. And I just skipped past it without even thinking. Or I just never checked it from a previous episode. One, two, three. Hey, got him. Okay, cool. <clears throat> After just playing Coliseum with the uh, the Pokeballs and stuff like that, like you can do a little swap where you can catch everything. Oh, Hurricane! No, you can catch everything basically in uh, in a Master Ball, and then you just swap the item slots, and it doesn't count as using your Master Ball. But you can't do that in Sun and Moon. All right, Gramble. I am going to give you a nickname, and we are going to trade you out. Because I believe it's fine. Uh, the team's probably not changing too much. Unless we got something astounding anyways. But more timid than Snubble, this Pokemon is dotted on by young people amused at the contrast between its looks and its attitude. So it's actually a nice Pokemon, but it looks crazy. I feel you. I, li I like Gramble, personally. Um... Well, Bradical M W L. Boom. Moon Wonder Lock. Uh, I'm gonna send it to a box because then we'll just we'll just do it right from there. So let's jump into our whatever it's called. I don't remember the name of this one. What is it? Festival Plaza, that's it. I said Poke Pelago, but it is not Poke Pelago. So trade on out. Uh, Wonder Trade, since we're playing a Wonder Lock. I get all, like, fumbled up when I start doing this stuff. I forget what I was doing. It's like, uh, what game am I playing? Like, that's what it turns into. Alright, so connect the internet as we switch the internet. Let's do this. Check in the data. Check my data, boy. Oh, man, it's really off on the bottom screen up there. That should be what I should be looking to. Uh, where those lines hit on this one. Well, I'll get that figured out. I'm not too worried. Where you at, Snubble? Gramble? Lonely Nature is actually not too bad for Gramble. <clears throat> and I would be able? I don't know. Looking to see how you turn off the uh, Wi-Fi on a 2DS. I don't, I've never actually turned it off, so I don't have to like... Worry about it. Just in case if I ever click the wrong Pokemon, I want to know how to do that, you know? Sure, I could just click the home button. Maybe. Or just turn it off, I guess. What up, uh, Samon? Samon? What do you got for me, Samon? Give me a, uh, give me like a crocodile or something. That'd be dope. I already have a ground type, actually. Give me, uh, 
Like a Weavile. No, we have an Ice type. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, Young Goose. Fair enough. You know what? <laughs> Fair enough. I couldn't decide what I wanted, so you decided for me. I think we already have a Young Goose, I would imagine. From the beginning of the game, we would have caught one and treated it out. I had a list for the longest time, but I've taken way too long to play this game. So, we're at like four months now I've been playing this. A little bit too long. Uh, it didn't say we uh, it re added it to the Pokedex, so I'm going to assume we already have one. Let's start another Wonder Trade real quick. Young Goose with the serious nature. Very booty, but... Searching for a trade partner. Please wait a moment. I can do that. Thank you so much. Maybe I can do that. I don't know. Level 4 Young Goose. Did you just catch this in the wild and you trade that out? Ugh. Same on, same on, same on. Used to be my homie, same on. What I treasure my partner. Amazing. Alright. <laughs> to Mim. Me is this Mim. Yeah, it was a meme. Mim. What do we got, Mim? Hey, we got an Ultra Ball. A Bunnel Bee. Well, you know what? That's different. I'm down for a Bunnel Bee. I did ask for a ground type, to be fair. I'm down for that. I like Bunnel Bee. The cute little guy. You can't dislike him, really. You can, but you shouldn't. Uh, Scopal. What's up, Scopal? <clears throat> Alright, out we go. Press Y to quit. I can do that, thank you. Disconnected from the internet. Okay, give me this. I'm not used to that yet. Hold on, I gotta forget. I forget every time I come back to Moon, I gotta play with only the analog stick. Frost Brad, that's pretty gangster, actually. Hold up. <clears throat> Alright, so Frost Breath. <clears throat> a rack when I can learn Frost Breath. That's actually not bad. We need to look at his moveset and see if that'd be a viability. For sure, we're getting rid of Mist. I know, I know. Mist comes in handy sometimes. It does have its viability. Hoof Picks learn Frost Breath. Now, I don't think we're actually going to use it on a rack when it, but I do want to see what her moveset is. I, we just looked it over, but it doesn't hurt to recheck it. Leech Life, Crunch, Bug Bite. We don't need Bug Bite and Leech Life. I think Ice has a little bit of viability on a rack when it. What do you read to? Rock? Rock. An Electric, I guess. Yeah, we don't need Bug Bite and Leech Life. What, Leech Life is base 80. Bug Bite is base 60. Yeah, it does steal their berry. That's cool. Haha, <laughs> great. Awesome. But Frost Breath is better, in my opinion, because you always get that crit. So if you really just need to get through something that's set up, it's nice to have it, you know? Learned Frost Breath. Dope. Cool. So let's keep moving along now that we traded uh, Ramble out.